All right, so in this video, I'm gonna be going through my handheld collection. I left out the Switch because it's not really handheld, but I got the Sony PSP, Vita, all the Game Boys, DS and 3DS. All right, before we start this video, like this video if you liked it, dislike if you don't, hit the subscribe button and then turn bell notification on so you get notified when we upload new videos. And let's get into it. All right, so we're gonna start from right to left. That's just how I've been doing them in the videos, I think. So that'll be how I'm gonna do it, but so I got my PSP, uh, most of the stuff I didn't collect growing up, um, but most of the stuff in these collection videos, I, I, it's not from my childhood, I have a very small section from my childhood, but I had a PSP growing up and I played a lot of games, uh, mostly God of War and Final Fantasy games, so that, that's mostly what I'm connect collecting and I'm collecting some like Jack and Dexter games that I never owned, but I really like, so, so we got Final Fantasy, uh, Four, I've never played a lot of the new, the older Final Fantasies, but I want to get into those. We got God of War, Ghost of Sparta, Sparta. I think that's a this is a um, exclusive to this, I believe. Let me know down in the comments if that's wrong, but I believe that's exclusive. Then we got Dexter, which is a, I believe another exclusive to the PSP. Um, I think it was on PS, PlayStation Vita as well, but, um, and I'm not sure, I've, I've never played this one, I played the rest of the, uh, Jack and Dexter series, but I haven't played this one. So we got, uh, God of War, Chains of Olympia. Again, I think it's another, I could be wrong, another exclusive for the PSP, God of War experience, so that's cool. Uh, another Final Fantasy, Crisis Core. I recently got the strategy guide, which is sitting right here now for this game, so that'll be fun to play through with that. Never played through that either. Um, and then, uh, Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep. Another one I probably won't play. <laughs> like you guys know, I don't play the Kingdom Hearts ones. I want to get into them, but that's part of my backlog. So, that was my small little PSP collection. I haven't collected too much for that yet. So let's get on to this Vita. So I got a blue and I got a black one. Um, the blue one's mine, and and the black ones of my wife's. Uh, she plays a uh, Sly Cooper, and she likes the Sly Cooper series, so I got her the collection that was on here. I like the Jack and Dexter series, so I got it on here, and it's got all three. Played on a handheld, which is nice. Uh, Sly Cooper, which I believe is, the, oh, this is the collection, that's a, exclusive for the console. Okay, so this is the collection that's an exclusive. That's cool. And then we got Mortal Kombat. I believe this one came with it. Um, I didn't bother trying. Like, I'm, it's fun, Mortal Kombat, but I'd rather play it on a console. All right, so we got this one standalone game, which I didn't mention when I was telling you about the consoles, because I don't actually have the console for this. This is for the Sega Game Gear, and it's, this is Sonic 2. Uh, it's got it's got Tails as well. Um, so I'm looking forward to the Analog Pocket, so I can play it. Um, and maybe if I find a Game Gear, I, I couldn't find a Game Gear that was in good shape that I wanted yet, so I'm hoping to collect that eventually. So I'll set that one down. All right, so now we get into the Game Boy. So that was all the Sony and the, the Sega. Now we're getting to Nintendo and their handhelds. I left out the Switch because I think it's more of a, a hybrid, and I use it more as a console, so I consider it more of a console than a handheld, but... Well, some people do consider it a handheld as well, or more of a handheld because, like, the light is a handheld. But I'm not going to go through that because I have a separate video for that. So look down in the description for that, um, and you can look at my collection that way for Switch. You can look at my Switch collection for in the video description. And so let's get into the Game Boy. So I got the, for the consoles, I got the, or handhelds, I got the original Game Boy. I believe is the original Game Boy. Let me know down in the comments if there's one before this. I'm not sure if the Dot Matrix one is different. Uh, and I'm trying to learn all of that and get through that. Got one of the Game Boy uh, colors, which has the Atomic Purple, which, you know, is synonymous with uh, Nintendo. And then we got a green Game Boy Advance. I thought it was cool. Um, and that's the only reason I got it in that color. I want to get a purple one as well, just because, yeah, I had that when I was younger. Um, and then... Uh, Game Boy Advance SP and 
that's blue is my wife's. Uh, I use more of the other ones or the DS. And we'll talk about that one in a second. But let's get through these games. So we got Pokemon Pinball. I haven't actually played this. It requires a battery and it doesn't have, this doesn't have the, sh the, the cover for it. But that was because it came free with the, the Game Boy. So I was like, oh, it's not a big deal. Um, so then we got uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Dark Duel Stories. Yeah, Dark Duel Stories for the Game Boy Color. Uh, it's Yu-Gi-Oh! It's really nice. Alright, so Tony Hawk Pro Skater 2. Um, it's Tony Hawk. It's a great game. Some, there's a rumor right now going around that uh, they may remake those, so that'd be fun. But, great game. Alright, then I got Pokemon Yellow. Um, I actually collected all of the Pokemon, and I'm still trying to collect some of the, the newer ones outside of the Game Boy line, but... I'm pretty sure I have most of them. Let me know down in the comments if you find that missing one. That'd be a great help to know which one I'm missing. So I got yellow. I'm gonna move this, these other ones across. So I got yellow, I got crystal, I got silver, gold, blue, and red. I believe are the only ones. I know there's a green, but that's in um, Japanese. So I might have to, you know, learn Japanese. That's my, one of my goals. And have to get a console for that and or a handheld for that and we'll try to play through that and see if it's much different than the red and play through all the japanese ones as well that's something i'm looking forward to so besides those ones so i also have the legend of zelda uh, Link's awakening which just got a remake um I, I don't know if i have a video on that i don't think i do if i have a video for that i have a link in the video description for that i'm not sure so legend of zelda Oracle of Ages. I also need to get Seasons. I believe it's Oracle of Seasons is the other one. And they're supposed to like complement each other. And I'm not sure if there's one you should play first or not. Let me know down in the comments if you know if you should play one of them first. Um, so I can make sure to play them in the right order. Alright, so now the advanced games. Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories. Wife's game. I'm not sure I'll play it, but... Uh, so this is The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past, and Four Swords. Two different games, I believe, on this. And I believe it plays like the GameCube. Let me know down in the description if that's wrong. I'm not sure. Pokemon Ruby and Pokemon Sapphire. I need to get Emerald. That'll be the one I'm missing there. And then we got uh, Yoshi Island, Super, or Super Mario Advance 3, Yoshi's Island. Or whatever way, direction that's supposed to be read. <laughs> And then we got Super Mario World. Super... These are weird titles. Uh, so it's either it's probably Super Mario Adventure Two, Super Mario World. So that was all of the games I have currently for the Advanced and um, the regular Game Boys. So let's go ahead and uh, get on into the DS. So the DS we have. A black one you know just normal it's also still got the cart reader down here and the the cart reader for the DS games just normal DS right I think it's the DS light I could be wrong let me know down in the comments if you know what exact model that is um, I can probably look it up too but so we got a teenage zombie which is a game that my wife wanted I think she had when she was you know younger so I don't know what it's about let me know down in the comments if you know what it's about. So I got this cheap at the Portland Retro Gaming Expo. So I got it, and that's why it's still in the little patch. But it's Pokemon Rangers uh, Shadows of Alma. Alma? Let me know down in the comments if Alma is the, how you spell that. I'm not, or how you say that. I'm not sure. But this looks like fun, and this looks like a different Pokemon experience. So that'll always be fun. Another Kingdom Hearts uh, 3... Three, five, eight by two days. I think is how it says. I'm not. I'm not sure. <laughs> Let me know down in the comments if I'm supposed to say that differently. Um, again, game parts. I'm not that into. Um, bookworm. My wife wanted bookworm. It's a good game. Stretch your mind a little bit. Pokemon Pearl. It's Pokemon. Let's go. Game hearts. Uh, recoded. She's trying to collect all of them, and so. I'm buying all of them for her, and she's gonna play through them. So that's all the DS games. 
3DS. So this is one that I have a little bit more of because right when I started collecting, they started coming out and they're cheap. They're cheaper. So so we got a uh, Pokemon Omega Ruby. I have Sapphire somewhere in here. So we're running into that again. Uh, Starfire 64 3D. You know, it's the select, so it was cheap. It was like 20 bucks. So I got it. I like Star Fox, so that's great. Uh, Bravely Default. I've never actually played these, but they're by Square, right? Yeah, by Square. So I'm sure they're great, and I've heard great things. So let me know down in the comments if you played, and let me know what you guys thought. Um, I think that I'll hop away have fun playing through it. So Ah, Sapphire. Put this right next to Ruby. <laughs> All right, so Super Mario uh, Maker. For the 3DS, you know, what can you go wrong? Uh, Zelda Triforce Heroes. I'm not sure if this is like a three-player game. I'm not sure. Let me know down in the comments if you ever play this and how fun it is to play with like multiple people. Maybe that'd be fun. Um, so this is an RPG for Mario and Luigi, Browser's Inside Story, and Browser Junior's Adventure Journey. I can't read. Uh, <laughs> So yeah, I think that's it's an RPG for Mario. Like I, I haven't heard too many that are bad, so I got it and I'll play through that. Legend of Zelda: Majora's Mask 3D. Um, I don't remember playing through Majora's Mask very much, so I need to play through these. Play through it on here, or play it on uh, 64 somewhere, so I can remember and try to make sure I played that because I played Ocarina of Time, and so that I think that's in here as well. So. Super Mario 3D Land. I always say world, but land is on the 3D, 3DS. And world is on the consoles, I think. Let me know down in the comments about that. Um, I always call this one the world, even though it's not world. But Super Mario 3D, like, that's great. I don't know why the Pokemon games are not together, but this is Pokemon uh, Ultra Moon. I have Sun in here. We'll get to that one at some point. Very disorganized. Uh, Kirby's Extra Epic Yarn. My wife likes Kirby. I like Kirby. It's a Kirby game. It's great. Pokemon Y. Also separated from X. I don't know what's going on here. Uh, Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon. The new Louis Luigi's Mansion 3. I have a video for that, the link will be in the description, but that's fun, and this one was decent, like this is not bad, so picked it up on the 3DS. Here's Sun, Ultra Sun, great game, not together, they're not going to be together. <laughs> uh, Animal Crossing New Leaf, I believe is the name, yeah, the title of this one. My wife likes Animal Crossing, I need to play through some of them. There's a new one coming on the Switch, so I have to get, you know, into the Animal Crossing. Pokemon X, also not next to Y. So there's another Kirby game, Kirby Triple Deluxe. Um, I'm not sure what, I'm sure this is like multiple games, but it's great. Kirby, you never go wrong. Um, except for the Switch one, the Switch one was okay, but it was kind of too easy, but Kirby. There we go, Luigi's Mansion, the first one. Um, the 3DS, which is announced after they announced 3 for the Switch, I believe, or it was before, and they everybody thought this was going on the Switch, not the 3DS, but I got it on 3DS. I will eventually get it on GameCube as well, but Final Fantasy uh, Explorers. I've never actually played this, but let me know down in the comments if you have and if it's good. Um, I like Final Fantasy, so I bought it. That's just the story behind that. Um, you okay watch three and i believe this is two nope one okay i think i need two so i got i got you okay i watch one and three um they looked really cute and something my wife might want to play and what i want to play it kind of looks like uh, kind of styled off as pokemon a little bit so don't really need to dive into those we got detective pikachu great movie now i can play the game I haven't got to it yet, but I do also have um, the Amiibo up here somewhere. Uh, you guys can't see it, but it's back there, I think. So, or it's over there. I don't know. I got the Amiibo, that's all that matters. 
All right, so we got uh, The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time 3D. So Ocarina is great. Bought on 3DS so I could play it portably. That's pretty much why I bought it. And it's on a select, so it's cheap. Um, I think they did pretty good with the... Um, they, like, kind of remade it. Not really. Like, it's it's an enhanced version, I guess, is what you'd call it. Something like that. But great. It's a great thing to play. Then we got uh, Link Between Worlds. Also great. You know, Zelda's all, all around great, so... I don't need to tell you guys about how great Zelda is. Um, if you don't know, what 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 have you been doing? Like, come on. But <laughs> so that's my 3DS collection. I have a the Super NES uh, version of the 3DS, and then I got a uh, this blue 2DS when it because it was cheap and my wife wanted a a little less heavy version than the 3DS, because the 3DS is kind of heavy, this is less heavy. She doesn't care about the 3D, so that's why I got that. And so yeah, this, this is my collection of uh, handhelds. Let me know down in the comments what your guys' collection looks like for handhelds, any of these really. Um, and like this video if you like it, just like if you don't, hit the subscribe button and then turn bell notification on so you get notified when we upload new videos. And thank you guys for watching this. You know, I missed this one, so I think that I just needed to do it so that I, I did the rest of my collection, so might as well have this on there as well. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.